We looked at the association between uh, testosterone and uh, thrombotic events such as myocardial infarction, stroke and pulmonary embolism in, um, in elderly men that were treated with uh, testosterone therapy. And we uh, found that the uh, number of deaths uh, were higher in the men that were not treated with testosterone therapy. So these were hypogonadal men with low testosterone uh, that ended up not getting therapy because of choice and they had uh, more deaths compared to men who actually received testosterone therapy. I think it's very important that uh, urologists understand that, that there are not too many uh, good studies that have addressed this question of testosterone and cardiovascular risk. And I think uh, this study sort of uh, addresses some of the limitations that are present in, in the large epidemiologic studies such as the presence of a control group, a very long follow-up of about three years. Uh, we had testosterone levels drawn on all the patients and we followed them personally and we verified the deaths with the National Death Index and we also called all these men in the study to make sure that these thrombotic events were accurate. So I think this study, uh, despite its small sample size and its retrospective study design, sort of gives us very good information uh, to counsel patients that testosterone therapy uh, can be safe in this elderly population if given right, if the patients are followed up appropriately uh, with the appropriate medications. This is the uh, only study that has been presented at this meeting on testosterone therapy and cardiovascular risk. Uh, I think as a community, we need to do more to address this question. I think the question of testosterone and prostate cancer, which was the most important risk uh, in the last decade, has been addressed by multiple studies enough that it is no longer such a big concern uh, for men. It is still a concern, but not the biggest concern. I think now that uh, cardiovascular risk has been proposed uh, with testosterone therapy, uh, we as a community need to do more uh, studies to address this question.